This comes as police are considering adding more charges against the suspects arrested in connection with the murder of Gardi, who was the daughter of former F Secretary General Godrich Gardi. Today, the Sunday Independent reveals that Sifo Makachwa, the first accused in the case, will be investigated for attempted murder. He allegedly tried to sell two albino children from his fiancée's previous marriage for R2 million for Muti to an Eswatini national. Makachwa was arrested after consulting a Sangoma from Nkomazi, Impamalanga, for cleansing after Gardi's murder. Police sources claim Makachwa allegedly told the Sangoma that he had killed someone. A senior police officer from Impamalanga claims the Sangoma added that Makachwa offered one of the albino children as payment for his cleansing, but the traditional healer refused. The Sangoma allegedly phoned the police after Makachwa reportedly failed to pay him for the cleansing. The Sangoma claims Makachwa has been consulting with him for years, and he has been giving him muti for different things besides cleansing him, a source close to the case said. Makachwa is also to be investigated for the murder of his former wife, Cecilia Sibia, who died in 2019 after allegedly being poisoned. Police suspect that Makachwa might have had a hand in her death, as the couple was divorcing. The Sangoma reportedly told the police that Makachwa allegedly came for cleansing after his wife died. Makachwa was supposed to get married last week to his fiancée, the mother of the albino children. We are following a strong lead on the issue of the albino children, but we can confirm that they were to be sold for R2 million so they can be killed and used for Moody, said a police officer, who asked not to be named as he isn't allowed to speak to the media. Philemon Luhele, an Eswatini national in exile in South Africa for years, is accused number two in the case and was arrested after Makachwa took police to his guest house in Nelspreit. He allegedly claimed that 28-year-old Gardi was gang-raped and shot there on April 29, before she was dumped in bushes 45 kilometers from Nelspreit. Police are following allegations that a security guard who used to work at the guesthouse was also killed a few weeks before Gardi for allegedly seeing something he wasn't supposed to see, the officer added. There are allegations that Luhel's guesthouse was often used for sex orgies. The girls are students around Nelspreit, and it is suspected that they were either drugged or intoxicated before the sex orgies.